During the 44-day war, the aggressor Armenia grossly violated the norms and principles of international law, including the requirements of the 1949 Geneva Convention on the Protection of Civilian Persons in Armed Conflicts and continued its acts of terrorism against the civilian population. From September 27 to November 10, 2020, about 30,000 shells and 227 rockets were fired into the territory of regions and cities with a dense population of Azerbaijani civilians as a result of strikes carried out by the armed forces of Armenia. Having been defeated on the battlefield, Armenia continuously launched rocket attacks on Ganja, Mingachevir, Tartar, Barda, Gabala and other settlements, committing war crimes and crimes against humanity. The armed forces of Armenia seriously damaged numerous property of civilians, destroyed residential houses, multi-apartment residential buildings, and non-residential areas. On October 11, 2020, 10 people were killed, more than 35 people were injured, and more than 10 multi-apartment buildings and more than 100 objects of various purposes were damaged as a result of the Armenian armed forces firing rockets at apartment. Buildings in the central part of Ganja It was also reported that 15 people were killed and more than 50 people were injured during the terrorist attack on October 17, a few days after this incident. In general, Ganja was hit by rocket fire for five days in October 2020, October 4, 5th, 8th, 11th and 17th. As a result, 26 people died, more than 120 civilians were injured, large-scale destruction occurred. Attacking populated areas with Tikiyu, Smirch, Scud and other types of destructive missiles aimed at killing a large number of civilians. Band cluster bombs were used during the rocket attack on the city of Barda. On October 27, 2020, 27 people were killed and more than 70 people were injured as a result of rocket attacks on the village of Karayuzifli of the Barda region, and on the city of Barda on October 28. On October 28, 2020, as a result of the attack of two Smirch-type ballistic missiles with a large destructive power, each containing 72 bombs, a total of 144 bombs. 21 people, including 5 women, were killed. 70 and the person received various degrees of bodily injuries. Between September 27 and November 10, 2020, 93 people, including 12 minors and 27 women, were killed and 407 people, including 50 minors and 101 women, received various degrees of physical injuries as a result of the firing of the enemy's armed units on the civilian population.